Among the Veterans Day ceremonies taking place today, a very special event was held at Miramar National Cemetery. It featured the unveiling of a monument dedicated to families who've lost a loved one who was in the service for their country. As many of you know, they're referred to as Gold Star Families. Here's KUSI's Ed Lenderman. Memorial Walk at Miramar National Cemetery. This tranquil setting features a grove of shade trees and in keeping with its name, a number of monuments, including a Blue Star Memorial in honor of all of the services. Now, just a few feet away, the newest monument, the long-awaited and COVID-delayed Gold Star Families Memorial. Thanks to the Woody Williams Foundation and volunteer committees across the nation, there are now 132 such monuments in every state. The latest San Diego, California. As for the foundation's namesake. He received the Medal of Honor on Iwo Jima, February 23, 1945, the day of the famous flag raising, one of the bloodiest battles in Marine Corps history. He went on to serve a career in the Marine Corps then the VA, and in his 80s, he, he was bored. He, he still had too much energy. He said, you know, th this Gold Star uh, cause is so important. Let's get a monument in all 50 states before I die. Mission accomplished. Williams died last year at the age of 98. Here's the beauty of all 132 monuments. They're all the same basic size, shape, and design, including the silhouette including the lettering on the front. It was left to the local steering committees in each locale to design the back. In this case, we've got the cemetery, the Coronado Bridge, and in tribute to Woody Williams, the flag raising on Iwo Jima. The unveiling included more than 20 Gold Star families, including a member who was also on the Memorial Steering Committee. Tony Cordero lost his dad in Vietnam. When it comes to Gold Star families, 92% of all of America's Gold Star families are from pre-9-11, from World War I, World War II, the Korean War, the Vietnam War, the first Gulf War. So this is a, a place of solitude and reflection for all Gold Star families. On the day the Marines celebrate their birthday, the guest of honor was Brigadier General Robert Brody, commander of Miramar's 3rd Marine Aircraft Wing. There is no such thing as a former Marine, once a Marine, always a Marine, so simplify. One and... At Miramar National Cemetery, Ed Lenderman, KUSI News. And if you are looking for Veterans Day events to attend this weekend,